Hello everybody, welcome into this new video. I'm going to be showing you how I can import some uh, stuff from AliExpress using Vsearch. Uh, I'm actually going to be using a Shopify online store. So in order to continue guys, I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description. So you want to have here your own your very first store here into Shopify. So if I click into view my store, you will be seeing here that here is a store that we created a few weeks ago. And here as you can see, I'm going to scroll a little bit down so I can see some feature products. As you can see, this product, these are print and demand, but this one actually is from Deezers. So what I did is to make an import so I can do some drop shipping and I can do some drip and um, print on demand. So what I'm going to be showing you guys is how we can import this and how we can customize this once we have uh, imported that and how we can have the order fulfillment so we don't have to do absolutely anything after the sale here. So let's get started. The first thing that you want to do guys is to go into your Shopify dashboard once you have created your account and you're going to be seeing something like this. So you don't want to focus a lot into the customization. You don't have to worry about that. We just want to focus it into the main items. So what I want to do is to focus it only into the apps. And here into apps, what I want to do is to go into recommended applications. And here, what I want to do is to scroll my way down and look at the Shopify app store. Here into the Shopify app store, what I need to do is to click in here and look out for the users and hit in here, Deezers AliExpress dropshipping. There we go, so Deezers is the main dropshipper of the AliExpress, so this one is gonna be really, really easy to just uh, install the application. So uh, before we dig in here, I can strongly suggest you to open a new tab. I'm gonna put this here just along with my um, Shopify section here, and I want to open AliExpress like that. And inside AliExpress, what I want to do is to sign into my Berry account here. So if you don't have an account, it's going to be just really easy. Hit into uh, sign in, and there we go. So I need to leave this open, go back into Deezers, and hit into install application. In my case, I just need to hit into the section that says open app. So uh, if you are entering here for the very first time, you just need to grant the access and sign in using your AliExpress. But in my case, I am already in here. So you're going to be seeing something like this and uh, the very, let's say the, the great part is that we don't have to make the integration because this was already been imported. So if you go into link to more stores that appears in here, um, what, what you're going to be seeing here is the installation once again from Shopify. So if you see the open up, that means that this one has been added automatically into your store. So what I want to do is to hit into update like that. There we go, I'm gonna just close this for a second here. And here we do have our store already added. So what I want to do now is to look for items that I want to import into my store. So you don't have to worry about the items you don't have added yet if you don't have anything added. I want just to focus into one item that can be, let's say, related into the products that I have added here. So I want to, let's say for example, look for this portable 300 millimeters um, electric air. So as you can see, we do have two items. We can choose the supplier optimizer or just use the add to the import list. So I'm going to choose add to import list. As you can see, it says imported. And I want to scroll a little bit down. If you want to see recommended products, what I want to do, so I'm going to type into the item that I just imported. And what I want to do is to scroll a little bit down. And here I want to look for related items so I can start digging into my own. So I'm going to scroll a bit down, I'm going to scroll down and down. There we go. So as you can see, it says seller recommendations. So here, this one is going to be helping me a lot to look out for items that can be helping me to import just more than once. So for example, here I have the coffee machine back case, um, the USB essential oil diffuser, the catch and microwave. So if you kind of like one of those, I'm going to be using this option and do exactly the same process. I'm going to just add this into my store. So when I, I want, want to go back here and I'm going to hit into add to import list. So choose the name of that one. I'm going to just copy and paste that in here and hit in, into search. 
because the item that we just saw is was actually inside the AliExpress, but we want to find that inside the Deezus. So I'm going to go here uh, and add this. I'm going to get into search here. There we go. And now what I want to do is to get into my import list. And now what I want to do is to click into this option that says push to Shopify. If you don't see that, I can click into the three dots. And here have the supplier optimizer, the apply deezer tag, the shipping info, and the lead. Just want to focus into push to Shopify. And here as you can see I have the pricing rule. The continuing selling when out of stock. The also published to online store. So I don't recommend to you to enable this continuous selling with when out of stock. Just enable this also published to online store. And here I'm going to push to Shopify. And I just wait a few seconds here. As you can see, it says product been post. So we do have successfully post one item. So if I go into my products, we are going to be seeing here our Jesus items that have been added into our store. So lastly, what I just need to do is to go back here into my store and go into products. Now here into products, I can see here that here is my actual product. So lastly, what I just need to do is to click in here and I'm going to change the title that I have available in here. So let's say, for example, I'm going to hit like this, um, all diffuser, and I'm going to delete this and I'm going to import something like portable like that. And here I'm going to leave the description like this because I, speaking about the description, as you can see, the description has been added uh, successfully to have everything I need to know about this product, the media was added automatically. So if I wanted to see something like the very first uh, item, for example, I want to people see this color. So I'm going to move that in here so I can see that the media is now, this is the, the primary uh, actual uh, product. So I'm going to scroll a little bit down. As you can see, the options has now been added automatically. The variants, everything has been added um, really, really great. So I'm going to hit into save. And then what I want to do is to actually go into my online store. And here into online store, um, if I want to make sure that my product has been added into my actual website, you need to make sure that your product has been added into a collection. So um, go back here into your products, select the item. And here, if you scroll a little bit down where it says collections, I'm going to click in here. I'm going to enable this into home page, for example, and I'm going to hit save. So once this has been successfully added, I'm going to go back once again into my online store. And here into my online store, what I just need to do is to click into uh, view your store. And I just want to make sure that my item has been automatically added. And there we go. So as you can see, the changes that we did into the Shopify has been added uh, now. And here are the images. And I can click in here. And here is my product from the price and the colors and the quantity. And this will be just added right away into my store. And I didn't have to do absolutely anything just to import that from Deezus into Shopify. And the rest is just going to be really, really simple. So with that being said, guys, we've reached into the very end of the video. So thank you so much for watching the video, guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you don't want to see more amazing shows about uh, Shopify and the import production from AliExpress. That means Deezus into your store. Thank you once again for watching the video, guys, and I will see you on the next one.